Welcome to a video from the digitallifestyle.com New Windows 11 build to look at. This is build 25151 to Windows Insiders on the dev channel. And this is a pretty small update actually. There's not a huge amount in this one, but there are some fixes. So um, the first one that Microsoft talk about is a file explorer scaling, which where some tabs would be too uh, large. And I haven't seen that issue at all. My tabs are working fine and uh, I've actually got really used to these using tabs in File Explorer now. It is a great way of being able to drag and drop between tabs and uh, you know moving files between each other. It's really simple and works really well. So I'm glad they've done that. And right clicking a tab when clicking somewhere else in File Explorer should dismiss the context mem menu reliably now. So I've seen that before where you get a context menu and then uh, when you're clicking somewhere it doesn't um, get rid of the context menu properly. So um, that is good to see that that's been fixed. So you've got, so you've got like a context menu like that, and then right clicking or clicking over there doesn't sort of get rid of it. Um, they fixed the issue with um, where shutting down via start wasn't working. So if you went and shut your machine down, uh, this was a bug introducing two five one four five, and they fixed that as well. It would reboot instead of shut down. Um, they fixed some issues hitting the Windows Security app that would crash, and some the exclusion page in the Windows Security app that, that it, it uh, makes better use of the space. And they fixed an issue when trying to delete ports with Print UI, and uh, some UWP apps not working correctly. So those are all the fixes. Actually, there's not a not a huge amount in there this week. There are still some known issues. They're working on issues with the uh, micro. A material and uh, acrylic blur effect on things like the start menu and notification center. I don't think I've seen any of those issues really. Um, mine's been working okay. And there's still an issue with the anti cheat uh, software that may cause your PC to crash. Uh, there's a new bug that they've added. Um, we're investigating reports that some inside are experiencing bug checks uh, with net adapter sys. Um, Starting with 25145, I've not seen that either. This is running on a, on a pretty old Surface Go actually, and there's been no issues with that. There's still some issues with uh, misaligned arrows in um, File Explorer as well. I think that's probably what we're referring to. That looks to me like that should be further down. Um, and there's still some issues with widgets and live captions. So that's it really. I'd like to be able to, uh, to show you more in a hands-on build video, but I can only show you what Microsoft have uh, released this week, but I do like doing these and showing you what's going on with Win for Windows Insiders. It's really easy to join the Windows Insider program. They've got a video on that on our YouTube channel if you want to have a look at that. Um, you get all the dev bits, all the, all of the bits that are coming out to future versions of Windows if you're on the dev channel. If you're on the beta channel, you get the things that are coming to Windows next, and currently 22H2 is in the beta channel. I release preview, you get things that are just about to be released. So um, you've got the choice. So I've got a video and an expl explainer on all that as well on our YouTube channel. So if you like this video, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one.